just going out to practice for a little while. Don't you think you'd better stay home and tend to business? What business? Uh, oh, show him, brother. Here, take a look, Mr. Kennedy. You're an interior decorator now. C. Edgar Kennedy and Associates. Interior decorators. Ah, I bet that surprises What's you, doesn't the C it, dear? For? You didn't know you were in business for yourself, did you? You see, brother decided that you should go in business for yourself, and mother finally hit on the idea of interior decorating. Oh, you know, every house needs a little fixing up nowadays, and and Mother thought there'd be a fortune in that business. <laughs> well, you know the old supply of lawn demand. When there's a supply, you must have the demand. You can't have the demand without the supply. Uh, well, I mean, if somebody's got to fix it. Oh, Edgar, dear, think of all the money we'll make. <laughs> well, where are we going to get all this business? I've had an ad in every newspaper for a week. And a sign in every barber shop in town. And uh, who's going to do the decorating? I studied mechanical drawing in high school, didn't I? Uh-huh. And Mother's going to do the draperies. You know she did these, and every time anyone comes in the room, they say they hit them right in the eye. <laughs> you can say that again. That's the trouble with you, Edgar Kennedy. Always criticizing. Well, it don't make any difference. We're not going to get any business anyhow. That's no so <laughs> oh, 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 oh. hey, What's the matter? Oh, give me that phone. Uh, uh, Edgar Kennedy and Associates, uh, interior decorator. Uh, something we can do for you. Oh, Mother, give me the... Oh, well, well, wait a minute. What are they saying? How can I understand what she's saying when you keep butting in all the time? Uh, oh, yes. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Say, what is this all about, anyhow? Oh, Edgar, put your hand over the mouthpiece when you yell that way. Uh, you'll pardon me, madam, but there seems to be somebody else on the line. Yeah, he says you'll pardon the madam, there seems to be somebody else on the line. Oh, I already told her that. I know you already said that, but she's got to hear it, hasn't she? What did you want, anyhow? She's already told me. She wants us to come over to her house and decorate while she's out of town. Oh, okay. Where does she live? Uh, just a moment, I'll get the address. Go get a piece of paper. Hurry up, get a piece of paper. Hello? Get the address. Yes, you know that I'm... Oh, yeah. oh, hello. <laughs> oh! Oh, we'll do a very fine job. Where is that pencil? I had it this morning. Oh, no. You had it. Oh, well, we have one. I need mean, no pencil. Oh, I know her very well. Oh, yes. With oh. black. With black. Oh, oh, stupid. We have some of the most wonderful ideas. Oh, just wait till you see. Oh, you'll be out of town. Oh, well, we'll take care of you. Edgar. 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 Make it out. It, oh, it's 1808 uh, 98th Street. No, no, no. It, it's 1776. That's the spirit. Oh, don't try to be funny. Oh, it isn't 1776. Oh, wait a minute. It's certainly 1776. Of course, any other address would be used for the wrong reason. It's 1776. You pay attention. Would you like a little snack, sir? 
Jameson, will you please let me alone till I finish my puzzle? Be that your wife is out of town, sir. She told me to remind you. Oh, Scram. If you pardon me. The rear entrance for tradespeople, please. Oh, we're not tradespeople, we're interior decorators. Puffy. Uh, yes, you see, we came to decorate your wife. She phoned just before she went away and asked us to take over. Oh, how do you do? Uh, we came to redecorate your interior. You see, your wife phoned just before she left and asked us to change the whole house from box to column. So you'll excuse me while I get busy. Uh, pardon me, please. Yeah, pardon me, too. You know, sir, I like the place just the way it is. Chuck them out. But your wife ordered it, sir. Oh, chuck them in. Uh, yes, sir. Yes. Edgar, come here a minute, dear. Come in, dear. Can I be wait till we get started? What's that? Huh? Oh, oh, that's mortar. Uh, I'm going to redesign this into a Moorish arch. Oh, that's the one with the round corners. Yeah. Oh, fine. <laughs> and then, and then this room will look out of the world with mother's new drapes. Oh, stop that! Stop that! I'll move the piano for you. Uh. Get me out of here, will you? Oh, get me out oh of here. yeah. Yep. My nose. Oh, my nose. Oh, Edgar, does it hurt? That's what you get for sticking your nose in things. <laughs> well, now, dear, you get that big chair and bring it over here. Run along and get busy. Come on, come on get up. Give me this chair. I will not. Get up off the chair. I'll call Ma. No. <laughs> Big boy. That's the perfect place for it, dear. <laughs> Edgar, this is no time to be taking a nap when we have so much work to do. I want you to help me with these drinks. Brother, this is no place to put a mortar box. Somebody's liable to oh, oh, wait a minute, eh? Mother dear, what was it you wanted me to do? I want you to hang these drapes. I'll be delighted.
Oh, how do you expect me to get anything done around here if you keep spoiling my mortar? I'm sorry. Well, that's better. Dear. Oh, Edgar, this is no time to be playing peekaboo. Will you move this picture for me and put it on that wall, please? That's a dear. Now, uh, just where was it you wanted this piano put? 
Oh, right over there by the French window, dear. <laughs> then all, uh, just step to one side, please. Are you ready? Ladies will step aside, I'll take that nude-headed guy first. Oh! What? Well, home again, Jameson. Where's my husband? Oh, he? Oh, he's in the living room. You like a double-barrel shotgun better than you do the single with the thing? What's the meaning of all this? And who are these people? These, my dear, are the interior decorators that you ordered. I didn't order any interior decorators. What? Oh, I oh, knew Lord, it. Oh, he got it up on the road. Shut up! They would... Step aside, my dear. Come out of there. Oh, yeah, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. There was something I wanted to ask you. Tell me, when you're hunting geese, do you shoot the first geese first or the last geese last? Well, I take oh, the one. Oh, 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 You were. Now look what you've done. Dinner is served. And if I'm not presuming, scram. Well, I guess that's the end of C. Edgar Kennedy and Associates. By the way, what was that C for? Show! Sure. <laughs> <laughs>